第三十二页，科普原地，易晕车的人看过来，了解动晕症，让你不昏头。Motion sickness causes and cures. Have you ever felt sick after riding a roller coaster, or perhaps long winding car rides make you dizzy? If so, then you have experienced motion sickness, and you are not the only one. In fact. One in three people is vulnerable to motion sickness, especially females and children aged two to twelve. Signs of the illness are varied, but can include a headache, fatigue, vomiting, trouble breathing, pale skin, and loss of appetite. There are different types of motion sickness, such as car sickness, sea sickness, or air sickness, but the common factor among them. Is that they occur when people are riding in some kind of vehicle. During the ride, motion-sensing parts of your body, including your eyes, inner ears, joints, and muscles, send messages to the brain. Your brain receives conflicting information from them. For example, in a moving car, your ears sense movement, while your muscles and joints sense that your body is sitting still. Your brain may have trouble determining whether you're moving or not, and the end result is that you feel sick. If you have motion sickness, keep your eyes closed and try to take a nap. This can relieve the conflict between what the eyes see and the inner ears sense. Another way is to focus on something that is not moving, such as the horizon in the distance. There are also some foods that can help. Like ginger or mint, if you tend to suffer from serious motion sickness, you can take medicine before the ride, whether it's bought over the counter or prescribed by your doctor. The good news is that motion sickness usually goes away shortly after your journey is over. So once you get on stable ground, you'll be fine in a few minutes.